what's up guys welcome back to my channel once again thank you so much for watching this video please don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel and also click on that bell icon so that you can get notified whenever i drop new videos thank you so much as you do that and god bless you um today i'm going to show you how you can import your trust wallet into metamask so um it's very simple and straightforward all you have to, the first thing you have to do is to open your trust wallet when you open your trust wallet like this then you copy your um, recovery phrase from trust wallet so i'm going to do that now so i'll click on settings then i'll click on wallets then i'll click on the three dotted lines in front of that wallet which is this one so i'll click on it and i'll click on show recovery phrase so i'll get my recovery phrase i'll copy my recovery phrase i'll click on continue then I'll copy my recovery phrase and then I'll go back and go to my uh, MetaMask. So I'll go to my MetaMask wallet. So I will log in to my MetaMask account. So actually, if you have a MetaMask wallet before, all you need to do first and foremost is to copy out your seed phrase for that account. You copy it and I'll keep it somewhere, somewhere safe, and then so that you will not lose that account because I'm going to log out of this account in order to import another account into MetaMask. And if you don't have MetaMask before, you can download it from a Play Store. Then. There is no need to um, worry about um, getting your seed freeze because you are you will register and new. So if you have account before, um, all you have to do is to copy out your recovery freeze and copy it somewhere safe so that you can actually have access to the account again when you need it. So I'll show you how to copy your recovery freeze. So you click on this three, three dash line by the top left side of the screen. Then you click on settings, click on security and privacy. Then you click on this reveal secret recovery phrase. So when you click on it, it will ask for your password to continue. So you enter your password and you click on next. So immediately you click on next, it will show your recovery phrase. So you can write it down somewhere or you copy it and keep it somewhere safe. So that is how that is that on that. So I'll go back. I'll go back. Then now I want to import my trust wallet into MetaMask. So I'll click on this three dash line again. Then I'll click on logout. I'll click on yes. So when you have a page like this, all you have to do is to click on this reset wallet. So I'll click on I understand continue. So you ask me to type delete. So I'll type it. I'll delete my wallet. So now this is a fresh page where you can import your trust wallet. Also, if you if you uh, if you are using MetaMask for the first time and you downloaded it from Play Store, this is the page that you are going to have when you launch the app. So what you have to do, all you have to do is to click on this import using re secret recovery phrase. And if you are not importing from Trust Wallet, you have to choose this option of create a new wallet. So if you are importing another wallet, maybe a Trust Wallet or any other wallet, you have to you know, choose this option of import using recovery phrase. So I'll click on it then I'll paste the recovery phrase that I copied from my Trust Wallet, I'll paste it here then um it's, it has me to enter a new password you can use the same password <clears throat> you can use the same password that you have used for your uh, previous account you can use it also for this uh, account as well so i'll input my password now yeah so i've input my password so i'll click on import click on import so you can see my um, wallet has been um, imported into MetaMask. So I'll click on done. So this is my account. 
you can see and and um i'm i'm on ethereum main network so in order to change the another network just click on this place where wallet is written then you can change to any network um like binance smart chain you can change to uh govan test network you can change to any network that you like so um when you import your wallet into metamask it might not show all the tokens that you have so uh, all you have to do in order to uh, import uh, your tokens into metamask all you need to do is to click on this add tokens then you will need the token contract address so i will head straight to bsscan.com bsscan.com no um first and foremost i'll copy my uh bsc wallet address i'll copy it from my wallet copy it my bsc smart chain i'll copy it and i'll head straight to uh bsc scan.com So I'll paste the wallet address that I copy, I'll paste it here. Paste and I will click on search. So it will print all my tokens that, that are on smart chain. So these are all my tokens that are on smart chain. So let's say I want to add this Kogi. I want to add it. So I'll click on that coin, which is Kogi. Then I'll copy the contract address, which is this one. Then I'll go back to my MetaMask. And then I'll place the uh, contract address that I copied, I'll paste it here. So immediately I paste it, when I click on this place, it should bring all the informations of the coin. You can see. So, um, when you do it like that, you click on this add token button. So you can see um, the, the coin has been added to my uh, MetaMask uh, wallet. So that's just a simple way. If you want to add any other tokens, that's the way to add any of your token and if it is on another network maybe like ethereum network you do the same thing you change the network back to ethereum then you go back to your wallet your trust wallet you copy the um the wallet address of your ethereum you go to etherscan.com then you search for the um this the same way i search for um my bsc token you search for it then you copy the contract address and do the same thing by clicking on these add tokens so that's the simple way to import your trust wallet into metamask thank you so much once again for watching this video please don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel and also click on that bell icon to get notified whenever i drop new videos also don't forget to share this video with your friends and family thank you so much as you do that god bless you see you again later